Hi, I'm Amy. And I'm Meg, and we're 22 Do. And today, 22 Do Cupcakes. In today's video, we're going to show you how to make vanilla buttercream frosting. It's really easy. All you need is some icing sugar, room temperature butter, some vanilla extract, and some milk. For equipment, really simple. You can use a bench mixer or a hand mixer and a simple spatula and you're ready to go. This um, recipe is the basis for a lot of our videos, so it's a really good one to watch just to get a hang of. So first step, we'll put the butter yep, in the mixer. You might need your spatula to scoop that out. A bit of teamwork. Okay. So what we're going to do first is cream this butter for about two to three minutes, maybe mm. a little bit longer. Yep, just till it starts to turn a bit paler in colour. Power. <laughs> power, power, power. power. On. So just a couple of things with this. Make sure your butter is room temperature, not too cold because otherwise it'll be a bit stiff and you won't... Um, a bit lumpy and it won't cream, it'll just be lumpy so your icing will end up lumpy and that is just gross. Gross. It's like whole chunks of butter in your icing, not a nice smooth creamy icing. We don't want whole chunks of butter. Mm -mm. So we'll start mixing and mix it on about medium to high speed. Make sure every couple of minutes you scrape down the bowl so you've got all the butter consistently and evenly mixed. So we've had this uh, mixing for about five or six minutes now. And what you'll notice is that your butter, we've got a nice pale colour and it's quite creamy. That means you're ready to start adding icing sugar. And make sure you add it gradually. So put half of your icing sugar in and half of your milk. Just keeps the mix nice and moist without drying it out too much. So we don't measure it out, just roughly guess about half. And half the milk. And then whiz it up again till it's well combined. And scrape down your bowl every few minutes as well. So we're just going to give the bowl a quick scrape down before we put the other half of the butter and, sorry, half of the icing sugar and the other half of the milk in there as well. Alright, I think I've got that on. Okay. Vanilla in yet. And at this stage, we can put our vanilla in too. can sort of put that in at any stage, really. We sort of forgot about it, so we're going to put it in now. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty, that's ready to go. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! You're right, you're covered in icing sugar. <laughs> Good idea to... Um, wear an apron. <laughs> wear an apron. Or when you first start mixing, put your beater on slow when you've got that icing sugar in there. Otherwise, you'll end up covered in it. <laughs> and your entire bench as well. I've got it on my hands. We're just going to give this one final mix because it's nearly ready. Just another couple of minutes to get it nice and fluffy and creamy. So once those are all combined, you'll have your beautiful basic buttercream icing. So this sort of icing is great for piping because it's nice and firm and it holds its shape when you use a piping tip with it. You can also spread it or dollop it on and you can see our other videos on different techniques for frosting a cupcake. And stay tuned for more videos on how you can use this frosting to make all sorts of different cupcakes. Subscribe and, yeah, to our channel. Subscribe. <laughs>